这几节课，我和我的团队 ，S B I 的团队啊，心情特别激动。感恩阿比总理。At this very moment, my colleagues and I are truly excited and deeply honored. We'd like to sincerely thank Prime Minister Abi and all the distinguished leaders who, despite your busy schedules, have traveled a long way to join us today in breaking ground on the historic Gaudi refinery project. On behalf of GCL Group, I'd like to extend my heartfelt gratitude to the government of Ethiopia, the Ministry of Mines, the Somali regional government, and leaders at all levels for your strong support in making this project possible. I also wish to thank the Embassy of China in Ethiopia and our Chinese business partners for their help and encouragement along the way. There is an old saying in China, when people share the same aspirations, no mountain or sea can keep them apart. Just two days ago, we flew more than 8,000 kilometers, 15 hours through the night, to return once again to Addis Ababa, fulfilling the solemn promise I made to Prime Minister Abiy two months ago. And today, the flower of friendship between China and Ethiopia blossoms here in the Gaudé Desert. The Gaudé refinery project, long awaited by the people of both countries, now officially begins. This is not only a new achievement under the Belt and Road Initiative and a step forward in China-Africa energy cooperation, but also a meaningful gift to mark the 55th anniversary of diplomatic relations between China and Ethiopia. Over the past decade, despite ups and downs and challenges through many economic cycles, the vision for this project has never changed with the strong support of the Ministry of Mines and the constant encouragement from the Chinese Embassy in Ethiopia, our confidence in investing in, developing, and supporting Ethiopia has only grown stronger. And today, that vision becomes reality as we break ground on both the refinery and fertilizer plant in Gaudet. This is a concrete step to carry out the important instructions of Prime Minister Abiy and your national leadership. In the coming hours, we will also witness the commissioning of GCL's first phase skid-mounted liquefaction project, as well as the groundbreaking for the second phase of the liquefaction project and the crypto mining project. Historic milestones that reflect the deep trust and strong partnership between Ethiopia and GCL. Under the wise leadership of Prime Minister Abiy, Ethiopia has become one of the strongest emerging economies at the heart of Africa. This inspires us greatly. The Gaudet Refinery Project with a planned capacity of 3.5 million tons, will become one of the largest energy projects in Africa under the Bell and Road Initiative. It is scheduled for completion by the end of 2027 and will build a complete industrial and supply chain from exploration and extraction to transportation, liquefaction, trade, and application. It will help close Ethiopia's gap in gasoline, diesel, and LPG, reduce reliance on fuel imports, and accelerate the country's industrial transformation. Most importantly, it will help realize Prime Minister Abiy's great vision of energy independence, industrial prosperity, and better livelihoods. And so here today, I want to make a clear promise. GCL will live up to the trust and expectations of the Ethiopian government. 
We will draw on our full industrial chain advantages, our strong technology, talent, and resources to manage this project to the highest standards with the best quality, the fastest pace, and the most efficient cost. We will build this refinery into a new highlight, a new model, and a new benchmark of China-Ethiopia energy cooperation. An endeavor that drives Ethiopia's social and economic development and improves the well-being of its people. Moreover, we see this refinery not as the end, but as the beginning. GCL will use this oil and gas project as a driving force to expand natural gas development, upgrade petroleum refining and chemical production, and integrate energy, power, and digital computing. Our commitment is to strengthen Ethiopia's green energy supply, accelerate industrialization, and continuously contributing to better living standards and greater happiness for the Ethiopian people.